such press conference ahead of our game against uh, Punjab FC. With us today is the head coach that's talking you along with defender Mehtab Singh. Uh, coach, we'll start with you. Tomorrow's opposition, and a newly promoted team in the league for the first time. What have you made of Punjab FC's debut in the ISL so far? Yeah, I think when whenever the league expands, it's great for many reasons. It gives us more games in the league, um, but more to Punjab, it, it brings professional football to that region. And I think that's a wonderful thing because it allows a lot of those young players, you know, not only to aspire to the ISL, but to aspire to the ISL on their doorstep. So you get a lot of young players from that region that can, uh, can feel part of it a little bit more. So look, I think it's their, obviously their first season. Um, we went to watch them. Uh, we were, uh, flew to Chennai, the day after our game the other day to go and watch them to again do the, the, the best that we can to prepare our team um, and they've got some good players they're clear they've got a very clear way that they want to try and play and we need to be ready for that so yeah but I think going back to it, I think for another team to be added it's great because it gives us more games and more so for that region in particular it's wonderful for for people around there because it gives them something closer to a spot could you elaborate more on the fact that you you actually went to Chennai and was so how do you assess their team? What, what are your thoughts on their team? Yeah, we go when we get a chance to watch. You know, we're obviously playing them in the next game, so it made sense with us. We had a day off. You know, we only get to see what the TV shows us. Otherwise, you don't get to see the full picture. Um, so by travelling there, it just gives us a little bit more insight as to things that we haven't yet been able to see. Um, so it's about preparation. Uh, we ask our players to try and prepare as well as they can for the games. Um, and as a staff group, we try and do as much as we can to prepare our teams as well as we can and where we can. Um, it's good to get around and see that, but more to try and prepare as well as we can for what we will face come tomorrow. You, this is your third season in the ISL now, obviously with Punjab being a new entrant into the league. What do you think uh, they bring which is different to the, the other 10 clubs in the league? Yeah, they've had a, a lot of change in their playing group. You know, so I think the same as anyone at the start of the season, same as us. You know, It takes maybe four or five games to find your rhythm, four or five games to find that sharpness and four or five games to maybe find your um, best or strongest 11 game by game. Uh, so I think uh, they're one of many clubs, same as ourselves, that are still working through that. Um, but with that, you know, sometimes you, you find that very early and other times you fall into that. So um, we don't know what team they'll face tomorrow or what team they'll field tomorrow or how they'll play. But the one thing that, again, I always talk about is making sure that we are ready. And uh, we certainly are. Uh, we have everybody fit and available again after a very short turnaround. Um, and I know the players are very eager to get back on the pitch at home, especially after playing for 90 minutes with 10 men. So, as a professional footballer from Punjab, how do you feel that you have to represent the team at top level? Mein represent बहुत अच्छा लग रहा है कि हमारा स्टेट का एक टीम ऊपर आया है एसएल में और अच्छे प्रोफेशनल लेवल पे खेल रहा है बहुत अच्छा लग रहा है और जैसे हम पहले भी खेलते होते थे पंजाब में तो तब भी एक था कि हम अपने स्टेट के लिए कोई हमारे स्टेट से भी टीम हो उधर हम हम भी खेलें तो अच्छा लगेगा तो अभी उनके साथ फर्स्ट टाइम अपने स्टेट के खिलाफ खेल रहा हूं तो अच्छा लगेगा एंड कल का मैच होगा उनका अभी तक चार गेम आईसीएल में आपको देखने का मौका मिला है हाँ पहले भी उनका चार गेम हमने भी मैच देखा हुआ है तो हम भी अपना बेस्ट देंगे वो भी आएंगे अपना बेस्ट देंगे तो हम अपना उसी हिसाब से प्रिपरेशन कर रहे हैं मैच के लिए क्योंकि लास्ट गेम भी थोड़ा हमारे वन मैन डाउन था लेकिन हम बहुत अच्छा खेले बहुत अच्छा किया लेकिन हम लकीली लास्ट में हमने किया तो अभी नेक्स्ट गेम के लिए और उस गेम में हमको होम गेम है तो और भी अच्छा करना है कुछ जिस गोइंग बैक द लास्ट गेम कुर्बा ऑब्वियसली गॉट द रेड कार्ड व्हिच मींस यू मिस टुमॉरोस गेम आई डू यू हैव टू चेंज अराउंड योर प्लान्स वेरी मच और टू गो फॉर हिज एक्शंस और इज इट गोइंग टू बी बिजनेस एज यूजुअल फॉर द टीम नॉट एज बिजनेस एज यूजुअल वी स्पोक टू द ग्रुप अगेन येस्टरडे आई थिंक व्हेन यू प्ले यू नो यू we spoke afterwards around sort of setbacks and i think when you have a send off especially as early as we did in 7 minutes and a debatable one of that um to then go and play 90 minutes uh, we obviously lost alkayati 8 minutes after the send off as well so we had to make that change we had two setbacks in the first 15 um and we spoke about 
the solid foundations that we have and the, the players have really bought into and built on over the last two years. And when you have that, when you do get those setbacks, the, the key thing is that we stick to what we know. And that was so evident in that game. And it was so important because we, it's a game that for 90 minutes we've played with 10 men. And I, again, I said afterwards, I can't commend the players enough for the work rate they put in, uh, not only to make sure that we come away from that game with a result, but the way they went about what they did. It was very controlled, very structured. Um, we actually went one up after an excellent move. And then the, the, the kind of kick at the end, which is conceded in the 96th minute, an equaliser and a deflection at that. Obviously, it's disappointing. But I think when you look back and you look at the understanding and the work that these players put in day by day, week by week, month by month and over a two year period, that was so strongly on show the other night to make sure that we come away with something from that game. Well, just a word on Metam, as, well as, as well as the rest of the young players in the squad. From your time here in, on posting your third season, how have you seen them grow and, and case in point with Metam? How have you seen him sort of evolving to that uh, important player in your uh, starting level now? Hey, you weren't playing when I got here, were you? <laughs> but he's one of many that wasn't playing. Now. Again, it's whether it's Metab, it's Fuba, uh, you know, uh, Vikram, it's something you could go on and on and on. Uh, but the key thing is just been how they bought into what we do. And I can't stress this enough. We, we come in and it was about trying to build an identity around what we did and how we did it but it was very important to share that direction with not just the players, but with the staff and the club. This is where we want to go, but more importantly, this is how you fit within how we want to get there. You play a very important role and the players have bought massively into it, Meta being one and then there's many others. Um, and when they do that, they learn how we're doing things. They learn how important they are within that structure and they understand uh, their role within everything. And I think when you get that, you get two things. You go a lot further as a team when you've got everyone working in a shared direction. And more importantly, I think for the players, hopefully it provides a really positive and supportive environment when they can actually firstly be themselves um, away from the field, uh, but more importantly, they feel safe and can really showcase what they can do on the field as a result. So it's a combination of those and it's credit to Metab and it's a credit to all the other players, that, especially the young ones, um, that have been able to come on and demonstrate that since, uh, since I arrived. And then I'll give you a similar question. Do you see yourself as a, as a senior figure in the team and, and how has your development been, especially last last year with coach Kander? हम बहुत अच्छा रहे ढाई साल के जैसे कोच के साथ बहुत अच्छा बॉन्डिंग है और कुछ भी शेयर करने में प्रॉब्लम नहीं होता अगर वो भी बताते हैं तो बहुत अच्छे से बताते हैं कि ये यहाँ ये नहीं तो अभी जैसे ये चौथा सीजन है तो इसमें बहुत ज़्यादा रिस्पांसिबिलिटी भी अपना एक रोल अलग दिखाना कि ये करना है हमको और पूरा अपना फोकस रहना है और हर मैच में अपना हंड्रेड देना है तो कोच के साथ जो भी कोच को चाहिए उसका मतलब प्लान्स में होते हैं वो समझ में आता है जो करना है हमने तो बहुत अच्छा लगता है ये सब नो एवरीवन्स वेरी कीन एवरीवन्स फिट एंड अवेलेबल फर्स्टली बट एवरीवन्स लाइक सेड एवरीवन्स वेरी कीन एंड हंगरी टू गेट बैक ऑन दैट पिच Uh, and to compete now for the full game with 11 players because I thought we were extremely good with 10 uh, but again we, we can't do that too often regardless of the situation um, but no everyone's fit available obviously with the exception of uh, Joel who's suspended but we welcome Roston back in um, but otherwise everyone's ready everyone's ready very, very eager to get back out and very eager to, to put on the type of football that we know we're capable of putting on Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, thank you.